In this video, we're looking at how you down an app to an existing Hike Vision MVR. So with a working system in place, all we're going to do is add uh, an app to the system. To make sure the app works, you need a, a network connection, you need an internet connection. So either connect to, uh, to, to your customer's router, if it's domestic, or connect to a, um, an internet, a network connection on site. In addition to the, um, the hardware you've got, you're going to need a bit of um, software. On the phone, you'll need the Hike Connect app which you can get from your local store. And in addition, you're going, perhaps you'll need um, SADP from the Hike Vision website. You, in this example, I'm going to browse into the machine through the web browser. So you need to know the IP address of the machine. Um, once you have that, you can simply just browse into it. You're going to need the username and password before you begin. Right, with that in place, we can start. And I'm going to browse straight into my machine. Um, I already know its IP address. So let's browse into it. There we go, a typical um, start screen you see on most um, high vision MVRs. At the top you have the navigation. I'm going to start with a configuration and in there you can change the platform access. So at the top let's click on configuration and then at the side there you can see um, the menu there that says network. Let's go to advanced. The sub menu in the middle and platform access Change the, the access type to um, Hike Connect. Tick the Enable box. That brings up a little warning. Click OK. And then Save. Now you can see how we're going to add the app is by QR code. So let's click Show. There it is. And there's the QR code. And this is the QR code you're going to scan in the app to, in, to, to add it to the app, basically. So with the... Um, with, the next step would now be to, to start the app up. So let's get the phone. As I say, you're going to have to register in advance. So at the bottom, you can see that little blue there for register. You do it for an email. And the final part is you get a confirmation email with a security code. And you just type in that code and click activate. And that will switch the, the app on. Next, we need to add a device. So I'm going to select that using the QR code. It opens a camera on your phone, click OK, and then you can scan. And there's my QR code. And once you've scanned, that will basically add the device to your app. So you click OK to that, add that, save that. OK to that, save again. A little warning, click save, let's skip through there. And whenever you're first using the app, you get a little tutorial about what all the buttons do and how to use it and so on. And you can scroll through. Um, some of the saved images you might have from the MVR, not on the all the images are saved on the MVR. The other thing you can do as well, um, you can start at the, you can see the name of the MVRs in the middle of the screen there, up just above the scrolling images. You can click on that, that'll take you to the MVR, go for a quick tutorial, um, and, and that will, then you can look at maybe a live view as well. So click on that. You can see if you remember, I only had two cameras up, um, so, and then you can click on one of the images. It'll take you straight into that particular camera. You can see a couple of our ComAV guys working in the lab there. And there we go. That's the app added and the system working.